finished taking my supplements and now I'm taking this Moon Juice Magnesium. And this is good for a lot of things. It's really good for muscle like aches and pains. So like post-workout magnesium. And this has a nice berry flavor. It's also supposed to be really good for like stress, anxiety, sleep. So um, hence the ohm. I like taking either tinctures or powders of supplements versus like actual pills. So. so we actually just got our new coffee table in the other day and I'm obsessed with it. If you guys remember from, probably would have seen it in my last vlog. If not, I'll show a picture. It was a like square, large marble coffee table, but it was just like way too cool cool tone for this area and we just moved our little chair here um the ottoman it's usually right here because we're doing some laundry but i love the way it looks it has this like display table for our coffee table books we're big coffee table collectors so this is from west Elm, 42 inches i'll link it down below if you guys are interested we're gonna watch some of our formula one drive to survive because the new season's coming out and then i'm gonna get ready we're gonna go out to yorktown so we're gonna get ready after that closer to when it opens and i'll take you along good morning i am currently just planning out some of my outfits for italy I'm trying to base it off of the weather, which is like mid-teens. I kind of pre-planned my outfits when we went to Paris and I felt like I did overpack. I brought things that I never even touched or wore. So I'm literally planning out my outfits to the exact with inspiration. So I'm making these little collages on Canva, doing items that I need for the look, what I need to buy, if anything, and how I can maybe alternate the look based on like accessories, like shoes, sunglasses, um, just so I don't overpack shoes and I don't pick different shoes for every single outfit. I can kind of like mix and match. I use Canva. I really love Canva for like all of my planning. And then I'll create like a little shopping list or whatever on my phone as well. Okay, so I've tried this so you can see what I see. This is actually my spring lookbook because it's gonna be like spring weather there. That's why I've chosen this lookbook. A lot of my inspo are of Rosie Huntington. I really like her style. My inspo picture, and I'll put the day that I wanna wear it, and then the items that I'll need and items that I might need to buy. Um, so I'll just duplicate this page. Saturday night. Okay, so I'm gonna go back to Pinterest and see. So here is a look that I did for Saturday during the day. I might change up when I wear this, but just to give you an idea. So it's this really cute, um, what looks like to me a cashmere sweater, a maxi like silk or satin skirt, some sneakers, and then just like a cute sharp bag and some sunnies. And then if I purchase something or I wanna purchase something, I'll typically find it on Google. Okay, so this is the skirt I got from Zara. So I'm just going to take the picture of it, save it, drag it into here. And because I have Canva Pro, I can actually remove the background. So I just remove the background. I apply, I'm just gonna crop it to the size of the image. And then there we go.
gonna quickly do my makeup before I go. Got my makeup pouch here. Just my Kosas concealer. So we're gonna go to Yorkdale Mall, which is like my favorite mall to go to, to look for just like a few more clothing pieces to bring to Italy with us. So I'm thinking I want like a nice light jacket. I'll probably get another like classic basic white t-shirt. I love the ones from Lululemon. They have really, really great ones. But I'm thinking I'm either going to get it a size up than what I usually get, or I'm going to look for like a little bit more of a structured Lululemon t-shirt or a structured white t-shirt from another brand. I just haven't quite decided yet And I want to look for another pair of jeans And some good just like layering pieces and I haven't been wearing a lot of makeup recently But like I find when I shop I like having my makeup done because I feel like it always looks better Like the clothes always look better. I just feel like more myself how I would look if I was out traveling touring I usually do like a light little everyday makeup routine there so I'll do a light everyday makeup here to go shopping so I get like really the full effect it's like my little five minute makeup because we have gotta go we want to be there for when it opens I use this really big brush when I want everything just to be super seamless and blended with no harsh lines blush I'm using the Laura Mercier ginger blush and I use my Kevin Aquan brush West Minute Atelier lit up stick I'm just gonna use my fingers and just warm the product up stab it Makeup is done. I'm just going to apply a bit of gloss once I'm changed, so let's do that. Okay, on our way to Yorkdale Shopping Mall to buy some Italy clothing pieces and just like spring pieces in general, because obviously these are pieces that we, we re-wear, not just to Italy. And we're dying for a coffee. I'm wearing my new like Ray-Ban sunglasses. Um, a light jacket. It's four degrees out. Obviously this would be like warm enough for me to walk outside in But just to like go from car to mall, it's totally fine And then I'll show you the rest of my outfit in like a change room or something Hang me outfit. So this is from Mass Marjorie You're breaking up quite a bit like more than usual. I don't know what you said Thank you we're just having a quick breakfast before we go shop Nordstrom Cafe we have these really yummy ham and Swiss croissants. They're just so messy. Lighting here is great. Oh shoot, that moves. Okay, we're gonna eat and then go.
All right, I'm with my little darling, Christina. We're gonna grab some Starbucks and then we're going to go to Melanie Ald, right? Yes. Okay, we're getting permanent bracelets, which I'm super excited about. We have wanted to actually get matching tattoos for a very long time, which is still on our to-do list, but like this is similar, but not as permanent. Like it's permanent, but it's not, I don't know. I've like started thinking about removing some of my tattoos. So I'm like very like nervous to get more though. I feel like if we get a small dainty one yeah. in like a non-visible spot, I think it's more like my really visible tattoos. I'm like, mm. um, anywho. Super excited to get the bracelets. Woo! So we're heading to do that, but we need a Starbucks first. We're both dying. Dying. Dying for Starbucks. So we're gonna get that and then we're gonna go. I'm gonna show you the experience at Melanie Ald and then I think we're gonna shop around because we're addicted to shopping. We're both Gemini's, so like what else is new? All right, we'll what see else? you then. <laughs> Your run was so like Carrie Bradshaw. <laughs> it always is. Yeah, thank you, love. Pistachio, Cheers. darlings. Cheers. This that one's mine. Nice. Yeah. That looks fancy. I know it's a cold brew. It's literally the best thing time. ever. With light ice, and then you just got a regular latte, like a pistachio latte. All right, time to go to our appointment. Oh, I love this song. Let me just classic shake. Mm. Do you know what kind of um, mm. bracelet band you're gonna get, or are you just gonna see when we're there? Um, I don't know. Probably like the daintiest one. Okay, wait. I need to put in maps. I think they're all pretty like, they are, yeah. dainty because I think it's solid gold, so you can shower in them and they don't tarnish. Otherwise, that would be pointless if they're permanent and then they. You know, I've seen these really cute. There's two sunglasses I like. One from Bottega Veneta, mm -hmm. which are like stupid expensive, and then the. Um, Celine ones. Remember, like they're like kind of like round like this. Yeah. They're very vintage looking, but those are like five hundred and seventy-five dollars. Like, I feel like that's insane for sunglasses. That Why is sunglasses crazy. so expensive. It's gonna go green soon. Like this is the most attractive angle of me. It's just like straight up. Are you filming right <laughs> now? I am. At least that's like the beautiful sunroof. You can see the light. You know what? too simple that's the one you, you like yeah right? yeah I think I like that one the most too yeah
freaking cute. Oh man. Oh yeah. I want to be tan. I feel so pale. Luke, I'm excited to do like a little oyster testing. Yes, that'll be cute. And some Caesar. Is it heat that smells good? Not it smells bad. It smells good. <laughs> smells good. No, this smells bad. <laughs> no, I said, is it you that smells? And I was gonna say smells good, but then I just said, is it you that smells? <laughs> and I just sniffed you. <laughs> and I meant you smell good. <gasps> I just keep smelling. So I, I just smell a lot. I just bought a new perfume that I'm trying what? out. Um, it's the Wild Cell Libre Intense. I think that's the one I'm wearing. That's why I was like, you kind of with like, the gold and like yes, um, and it's interesting like, top. Yes, and it's like a dark, dark color. Yes, yes, I'm wearing the exact same one, and I was like, you smell like you smell like wool. Mm. It's it um, sweeter on you. It smells different, sweeter on different people, or like it smells different on different textures. Where did my stick go? Oh, it's in here. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, it's dripping everywhere. I love these little completions. Oh, yeah. Here we are, cheers. Mm. Choosing from a different angle. Oh, delicious. These are our sexy pecs. What are these? Maraschine? And then Simon. Simon says. No, I don't mind. We need enough on everyone. Little bit of horse yeah. And then, yeah, the chef. love that. Love that for us. With the onion, or um, garlic. Yeah. Okay, ready? Cheers. So fresh. Fresh. They're big guys. Yeah, it was nice, thick, thick guys. Yeah, I took a couple chews. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it wasn't just that 